At first glance, it looks like just another box of shapes and puzzle cards. But don't be fooled. Mighty Mind is an intricate linear program disguised as an entertaining activity. Without a child realizing it, Mighty Mind becomes a confidence-building pathway that draws a child step-by-step step through a succession of increasingly complex mind-building challenges. Mighty Mind uses a series of chain-linked puzzles that are arranged in a numbered order. No reading is required. Any child can start, even as young as three. The trick is to keep the puzzles in numbered order so a child will become absorbed and easily flow through the logic-building experience. The first puzzle is simple enough for a three-year-old. The pieces required to complete the circle are shown, so a child only needs to match them and maneuver the parts to construct the circle. That was easy. The second, third, and fourth puzzles follow the same format. Confidence is established, so the fifth puzzle adds an additional shape. The sixth and seventh puzzles use identical shapes to create entirely different figures, stretching a child's young mind to envision wider possibilities. The first ten puzzles use only the larger shapes, making it easier to manipulate the pieces while building dexterity and important motor skills. In the next sequence, a wider variety of shapes and recognizable figures of increasing complexity are slowly introduced, building a solid logical foundation one step at a time. By the 15th puzzle, a child can construct a little car because the previous 14 steps developed the necessary skills required to select the needed parts and arrange them in logical order. The first 20 puzzles progressively build a child's confidence and self-esteem, motivating a child to attempt each ascending level in the chain. Success feels good, and the linked puzzle chain builds success in little increments. A child reaching the 21st level will have developed sufficient thinking skills to independently construct a bird, a dinosaur, a basketball player, a farm, a frog, and so forth. By the 30th level, a child can analyze, select, and formulate puzzle solutions that many adults would have to double-think their way through. Every child will reach the same skill level independently and on their own. A bright child may breeze through the 30 levels, while a slower child may take longer. But in the end, both children will have achieved the same skill level. A little child will achieve going from assembling a simple two-piece puzzle to constructing a little car, to developing enough skill required to think through the intricate matching of dissimilar elements and building a pattern that some adults could hardly complete. 